Hey Bellamy, it's Sam. I just want to wish you a happy, happy birthday. I hope you are having an incredible day surrounded by so much love and hugs and you're getting to spend it with your loved ones. And I hope that 2018 is even more incredible and wonderful and full of adventure and creativity and I just can't wait to see what this year brings and I can't wait to continue following you on this incredible journey because you're amazing and deserve the absolute world. Um, thank you for being such an incredible role model to me and just for being such a genuine, compassionate, humble and selfless woman and I'm so grateful to be able to call you a role model and be inspired by you each and every day and thank you for bringing a smile to my face. So happy, happy birthday Vels, I hope this day is just unforgettable and so beautiful and I hope this little video brings a smile to your face the same way you do us. We love you. Hi, Bellamy. It's Ash. I'm so excited because it's your birthday. So happy birthday, Angel. Well, first of all, I would like to wish you a beautiful day filled with love and peace and the people you love and serenity and all the human beings who ask for. Happy Bellamy. I hope you're having a day full of love because you deserve it. Bellamy, happy birthday. I hope this year is everything you could have ever dreamed of and more because you deserve all the happiness in the world. Happy birthday, Bellamy. I hope that you are having the most amazing birthday possible because today and every other day, you deserve to just be surrounded by so much love and kindness because it's exactly what you put out into the world every day. So I hope that everyone around you is just treating you amazingly and that you're beyond happy today. Happy birthday, Bellamy. I just wanna say that I hope you have a fantastic birthday. I hope you have a fantastic year because you truly deserve it. You are the most amazing human being and the most amazing role model that I look up to and to so many of us in the fandom look up to. I love you with my whole heart and I can't imagine my life without you. I'm so thankful that you were born um, and I'm so grateful that I get to live at the same time as you do. I just hope you have the most magnificent birthday, that you are happy and have fun and get to relax and are spoiled rotten because you totally deserve it. And I just hope this next year is magnificent. I can't wait to follow you and see what you do next because I know it's going to be amazing. So happy birthday. I love you with my whole heart. Happy birthday, Bellamy. It's Charlotte here. I just want to say I hope you have the best birthday and it's the best year yet for you because you are amazing and you are so, so kind and you deserve the world. I'm so, so grateful to be able to share even the tiniest part of your journey with you. I love you. Hi Belle, happy birthday. I wish the best for you. A lot of love, happiness, success, health. One of the best things in the world because it's servant. You are an amazing person, an amazing actress, amazing human. You are so lovely, kindness, talented. And I'm really proud and grateful to be your fan. So thank you so much for all you did for me, all you do every day. You are in, you inspire me so much. So, I love you, I love you, I love you. It's you, I'm coming to Brazil, because I want to hug you. <laughs> and happy birthday, enjoy our day, enjoy our new year. Kisses. Happy birthday! I hope it's with a lot of tears, and if there are some tears, I hope it's from all the laughter. I hope you're surrounded by love, the ones that you love, the ones that love you back. Have the greatest days ever. Happy birthday, love. Hi Bellamy, my name is Kayla and I am actually a pretty new fan of Scandal. I just started watching it about two-ish years ago. I found it on Netflix and I fell completely in love with the series and all the cast. I do have to say that Melly is definitely my favorite character. I've seen such 
growth since the first season like wow amazing and it's amazing also to see a woman president I just had to throw that in there um, but I've also had such an amazing time getting to know you as Bellamy through interviews through social media through everything I just I so admire the person that you are and I aspire to be like you you just greet everyone with such kindness and compassion that's just amazing so just wanted to say um, happy happy birthday and I hope that you have a great day Hey Bellamy, it's Anna. Um, I hope you have a great birthday and I hope your day is filled with lots of love and fun and food because food is always great. Um, I hope this next year brings you a lot of happiness and joy and many adventures. I can't wait to see what this next year brings. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Belayme. I hope you have a great day. I love from Norway. Enjoy. Hi, Bellamy. Uh, my name is Cassie. I am one of Sam's uh, best friends on Twitter and Instagram. At least I hope I'm one of her best friends. <laughs> Definitely one of her friends. Um, and I just wanted to wish you a happy birthday and say I hope you have a good one and uh, have you know, the time of your life. Drink lots of alcohol, let loose, relax, have fun with whatever you're doing. If you're with family, friends, whatever it is that you're doing, have fun. You know, if you want to take a nap on your birthday, go ahead and take a nap. If you want to go out and act crazy, make a fool of yourself, go do that. Uh, if you want to sit at home, you know, by the fireplace with your PJs on and a soft warm robe uh, with slippers, do that drink some hot chocolate watch one of your favorite movies or tv shows do that whatever you do i hope you have the best time and uh happy birthday hope you have a great one i will uh see you later bye hi bellamy i'm taylor i'm one of your fans and i'm just here to wish you the biggest biggest happy birthday ever and i hope it's an amazing day, so think of all your loved ones and your beautiful, beautiful little pets. Um, I just can't thank you enough for everything you've done for me, for all the love that you've shared with me. You're just, you're incredible and you deserve the best day ever. Um, yeah, I just, I love you so, so much. Thank you for being one of the most incredible role mo models ever. <laughs> love you so much. Hey Bells, my name is Fran. I just want to wish you a very happy birthday. My favorite moment has to be 110% when you commented advice when I went to the City Thank You Dance 24-7 dance convention. You commented and my heart skipped a beat and I kept that advice so close to my heart with me. My favorite memory, I think um, it was this TV show and she was playing this game and she was asked if you weren't an actor, what would you be? And she said, a mess. And yeah, I was like, that's so accurate, like, yes! What I would like to say is, I'm sure Melly is for you as much as an inspiration that is for us and especially for young girls like me who wish to make a change in this world and I would like to say thank you for portraying her the way you do and you are a beautiful human being, Amy, we love you. And my favorite moment is when I listen to your songs because I close my eyes and I just dream of this magic moment. Happy birthday! Of course, my favorite memory is the night I got to meet you at the Voices of the People's History event and seeing that program it was phenomenal. Uh, but having that time after to talk to you and take pictures was so special and something I'll never forget. That picture where I asked if I could pretend to kiss your cheek and then all of a sudden there was your cheek on my lips. So. Now I have that picture of me kissing your cheek. <laughs> hey, Bellamy. So 
I wanted to talk about the first time I got to meet you because it was something so special to me and something I will literally remember forever. And I had just driven eight and a half hours. I left my house at 4.30 in the morning. I was with my dad and my sister. And we were at this huge pride event and that was insane. And I just remember seeing you and I was like, oh my God, this is the person that I look up to more than anything in the world. And and my body was shaking and I just went up to you and you knew who I was, which was amazing. And I just gave you a hug and it was great. And I felt so special. So thank you. And I love you so much and I hope you have the best birthday ever. My favorite memory with you is last March, um, I tweeted you this really long letter about basically my life and all my struggles with my emotionally abusive mom and getting out of uh, my depression and how you helped me through it uh, just by being you and you saw it and you were kind enough to read it and reply to it on TGIT and um, you basically said that it was a gift and you thanked me for it, um, which I, I thanked you, I mean, I thank you for even responding to it and taking the time to read it, but um, you said that you were humbled to be part of my path and that um, you basically loved me. And it just, every single time I think about that, I just feel so happy and it puts the biggest smile on my face. And it just really made my whole entire day and every single time that I'm going through something or I have to talk to my mom again or for whatever reason and I'm going through something, whatever it is, I think about that and I look at that tweet and I just feel so much better and I feel so much more inspired and so much more motivated to keep going and to persevere through everything that I might get hit with because it's just... it. It makes me so happy knowing that the person that I look up to the most cares to a certain extent and I feel like you're actually like there for me. So yeah, I hope you're having the most amazing birthday ever. I love you so, so, so much and thank you for being the incredible and inspiring woman that you are. Happy birthday. My favorite memory with Bellamy is when I called in to watch what happens live just like hoping I would get through, but I actually got through and I got to ask her a question and then I actually tweeted her the video that my roommate took of me on the phone with her, me getting like super excited. So I tweeted that to her and she ended up seeing it after a while and I just am glad that she saw it because she got to see how excited I was just to talk to her on the phone. Um, I can't wait to hopefully one day be able to share this a memory saying that I got to meet her. But for right now, my calling in to watch what happens live is my favorite memory with Bellamy. Um, one of my favorite memories with you is that you always seem to know when I need you most. Like when I'm really, really suffering or really, really down, you always seem to tweet or comment on, a, on a my Instagram photos and it always um, reassures me and shows me how much you care and it's like you just know. <laughs> Another one is um, when I live tweeted your lip sync battle. It was a great, great example for me of um, confidence and pushing yourself outside your comfort zone and the fact that it can lead to amazing, amazing things because you killed it. <laughs> and being able to share that with fellow gladiators too was a really, really amazing experience. Um, I hope you have the best day and I'll see you soon. favorite memories. My favorite memory of all is of course when I got to meet her at the end of last year after uh, Peter's concert uh, at Fabrica. Um, I was with two of my best friends, I was with Maggie and Mia, and it, it was everything perfect. I had to meet Bellamy and me and Maggie were fine meeting one another. So it's everything come together. It was perfect and I loved it and I hope uh, see you again it'd be fantastic in Portugal so that means good things <laughs> my second favorite memory is uh, when I was watching uh, 
your interview at the Sega, uh, with the Sega, I mean, and you were talking about Melly being raped and not telling fits for over 16 years or something, and you talked about something that was very different to my heart, and you replied to one of the most personal things I've ever shared on any kind of social media. It was straight to the heart, so it was very meaningful that you had to just took the time and read that thing that had been on a draft on that link for over three months and having me while I was having getting the courage to send it to you and when I finally did it I thought I would just send it this and you won't read it but you did and it meant a lot because it's, it's still one of my pain and twists after like four years <laughs> And my favorite moment of yours would be when you commented on my Instagram video that I made for you. It meant a lot to me that you liked it. And um, yeah, I hope you have a very, very great day. And don't forget to eat a love cake because that is important. And I hope you get some great presents and have a lot of fun. Bye! Remember your roots, trust your wings is 100% my favorite quote from you. It really teaches me and reminds me to be myself and to never forget who I truly am. Again, happy birthday. We all love you so much. My favorite quote of yours is remember your roots, trust your wings. Because only by knowing who we are, we can set high goals and make our dreams come true. And although I haven't met you yet, I really hope to see you one day in the future. There was something that you said in 2013 that has recently been on my mind and it was to just make sure your dreams are your own, especially when you're young. You have to make sure you're on your own path and especially as I'm coming up to my college graduation and I'm here interning in Washington DC, there's the Capitol in the back, um, it's just something that is a good reminder to me that things will work out and that I'll find the path that I'm supposed to be on. And so I'm so grateful for your wisdom always. Um, my favorite Bellamy quote is you were on Larry King one time and um, you were asked what your, what your superpower would be if you could have one and you said comfort in a room full of strangers. That is by far one of the most amazing and inspiring and just genuine things I've like ever heard in my whole life. Um, I love that quote of yours personally just because it just really shows how genuine and how kind and how selfless to a certain extent of the person you are. You re it just really expresses how much you really just want everybody to be happy and everybody to love each other and everyone to always feel safe and comfortable no matter where they are, no matter who they're around and yeah, that's why that's my personal favorite quote. My favorite quote from Bellamy is, remember your roots and trust your wings. Um, that's always been my favorite quote since day one. Um, it's just one that always sticks in my head and sticks out when somebody asks me what my favorite quote is. Um, it's very, I don't know, it's personal to me. Um, I can relate to it very easily being from a super small town and then leaving for college. Um, it just always reminds me, you know, just remember where you come from while you're spreading your wings and becoming your own person and it's just so simple and it's just it's beautiful and I love it. Um, one of my favorite quotes of yours is just be yourself and you'll be fine because as a person who suffers with self-confidence and who's really really scared about what the future may hold it's so reassuring to think that you believe that just being yourself will lead you to amazing places. Remember your roots, dress your wings. My favorite quote is Remember your roots and trust your wings. It was stuck on my brain when I defended my thesis a couple like years ago. Um, it was constant on repeat and it was something that helped me get through it and not actually throw everything out of the window. Literally, it, it came to a point that I just wanted to throw everything out the window. 
favorite quote of yours would be I think true beauty is everywhere because it's very inspiring and I really really love that quote. 